and I really want to go to all the vintage cute stores so we can check something for our trip. Mm -hmm. A visa trip. It's <laughs> advisor advice. Um, I would only invest people would arrive look at this and this is a small portion okay guys uh, mo models, no. where we are going funny enough we are going to, <laughs> we're going to have brunch and ruta can't really eat eggs and play <laughs> and place is called egg break <laughs> apparently it's like really well rated um brunch place in northern hill and i always wanted to try it's impossible to book and they don't take any reservations sadly and I'm gonna be sitting and watching her eat. That will take. You can oh, tie them. The oh my god. Okay. Look at no. And the people around there. What's inside? Like so okay, oh Princess is not queuing, so here oh, we go. Whenever like things go viral, it's like a chicken box. Everyone gets the favor. Now <laughs> like it's a 15 minutes queue. No so, way. Um, no, 15 minutes queue just to get to the hostess. Yeah, I'm no. Not even, I'm not even talking about the queue to wait for the table. Okay. Morning stopped, guys. Notting Hill has so many um, really cool brunch places. Sometimes it's sad because you cannot book, so you need to just go and hope, pray for the best or stand in the queue, which is super annoying. I hate no, that as well. But we're gonna manage so we have a target we have a goal now where we're going so let's see and i really want to go to all the vintage cute stores so we can check something for our trip mm -hmm. a visa trip it's this coming up in two weeks yes um, super exciting and we were talking actually about sustainable fashion and yeah. how important it is to understand that it's okay to for example recycle clothes meaning that buying from secondhand shops we have quite a few oh my God. really nice pieces from second hand shops. Totally. And I'm I'm really loving them because they're excellent finds. Yes. And I personally also think that whenever you stop using, stop wearing your items, you can always sell it on vintage or there are so many or like eBay. Yeah. I am a chronicle outfit repeater. So when I find the outfit that I really like or I buy the clothes, and let's say this cost dress. I bought it last year. I love this dress. I wear it to kind of to go out in the evening for a nice dinner. You can dress it up, dress it down. And I love re-wearing clothes that looks good and I feel good in them. I don't see anything bad in it. And to be oh. honest, oh, <laughs> I killed myself, <laughs> my God. What and, a morning. And I think from the financial aspect, the best investment. As long as the clothes are good quality, it doesn't need to be branded. So yeah. I will do you find a place. I think I will lost. Okay, I have a lost. Okay. So we came to this place called Aphrodite. Cafe Aphrodite. And it's gonna be more like a lunch place. But you see like what I like is that they straight away give you something green. Instead of only giving you bread, they give green starter to start. So that's your fiber and then you can easily go and eat whichever main you want <laughs> this is very cute we are, what I was saying that we are models we, we are models eat. because just we're just having this for lunch <laughs> <laughs> okay guys we are joking we're not only having I this I love models yeah but I felt like you know <laughs> the, the lady on a very strict diet is a little halloumi and the tomato we, we, so we thought we're gonna find the brunch place however we passed by this a greek restaurant with an amazing ratings in notting hill aphrodite so we ordered a bit of halloumi uh, a greek salad and some i think meat no or fish that's it but the weather is perfect and i think uh, we are drinking water and we are drinking the glass of water Greek water. Greek water. <laughs> so we stay forever young. <laughs> oh, and like a goddess. Ooh. 
food arrived. Look at this. And this is a small portion. Okay, hey, guys. Mo models no more. <laughs> models no more, yeah. Oh, but this makes me happy. Look yeah. at this. this I just so don't good. need the rice. But they yeah. they came this kind of together and I mean, like, whatever. It's fine. Salad, protein, and then carbs. Yeah. And the little starter vibes. Coffee order. I really like this coffee. It's called Hagen. This is such a good coffee. So this is a vibe in Notting Hill, guys, now. And you hang out outside the coffee bars rather than the alcohol bars, if I can say that. And uh, there are so many amazing places to eat and have a coffee. <laughs> Summer in London. Honestly, everyone is so happy and as you can see on every single corner everywhere you have super cute places. This is a vibe, guys. If you come on the weekend, oh, look at how cute they're. Only in London. <laughs> we are thinking which boobies do we have? <laughs> which ones? <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you. You are so inappropriate. <laughs> I know. I'm always inappropriate. Some duckies. So we have very fond memories of this square and especially this place. So 10 years ago with our Portuguese friends, we would come to La Bodega uh, to, have, to have sangria. <laughs> and Ruta is ready to go to have sangria. Exactly. Also, let's adore Ruta's outfit. The most Double Look at the madam! Mm -hmm. Adam got the vintage earrings. I love it. It's a clip-on. Well, yeah, because you need to put it properly. My earlobe is sweating. I love it. They are very kind of vintage. Very heavy. Yeah, but it looks nice even with your look. I really like it. I'm feeling this. No, no, honestly, they will be fine. I really like it. Very pretty. <laughs> In Notting Hill, there are so many stylish people. Like, they look so good. I am shocked. Like, it's, they are very um, stylish because they also shop in all these unique places. So, vintage stores. Yeah, vintage stores. Because, like, their things are so unique. I, I've never seen anything they wear in, in like, mainstream shops. No. So, we were talking about the luxury pieces. Yeah. And pieces worth investment. For, like, for example, <laughs> if you have spare few thousand <laughs> and you want to spend it, where would you, for example, spend it and what would you buy? Yeah. Like, what would be your next next luxury purchase? Good investment piece and why? From investment and finance perspective, we have a finance advisor here. <laughs> finance advisor. Finance advisor advice. Um, I would only invest, I would never invest in clothes or shoes because you will never get your money back. I would invest in jewelry. But then I think, I think jewelry pieces have uh, value, like yeah. deep value, and you can sell it. Sometimes, like I look at the Cartier, for example, or Tiffany, or yeah. any other like watch brand. And to be honest with you, to buy used, it's so expensive. It is. It's and so expensive. every year they increase in value. Yeah. So, like Eva said, if if you want to invest and put your money somewhere a little bit more valuable. Uh, certain handbag brands, jewelry, and watches. 
certain pieces. Again, before putting your money and spending your money um, in the luxury, just do a good research. What do you want to buy next? What do you want to buy next? I still need to think about it, but I really want Cartier watch. Okay. I would like... I'm very happy with my vintage earrings as well. We bought some vintage earrings, which are super cute. Um, for my next luxury purchase, I want to... Well, I want to watch because my watch is very, very old, but I have... Yeah, it's almost like a vintage, but... When I buy watches, very sentimental for me. I really want the Hermes Picotin. I found this bag super cute. Um, it's not an investment bag, but I still like this bag a lot. Yeah. Hermes it is. Just my Mine preference. Well. Yeah. And I will. I would get vintage. I don't have a classic Chanel flap. I'm regretting big time that I haven't bought years ago when I could. But now I just cannot justify this money at all. It's just too much. I saw one chocolate Chanel flat bag. Oh my god. It's beautiful. It's stunning and with all the hardware. Oh my uh, god. So I, I would go for that rather Me than too. black. Um, and what would be your next purchase if you have something on your wish list? You know, you're saving up to or something. What what, what piece that would be? Or like Birkin, Hermes, give 25. Us some, give us <laughs> bougie in the comments. Oh, we love bougie comments. Yeah, yeah. Guys. So we are on the way back home because Notting Hill is closing down and we are last guests. Notting Hill Market is closing down and oh, so good. Um, and I think we're gonna end this vlog here. Yeah. Hope you like it. I think it was a little bit of everything. Yeah, we had some we showed interesting discussion. discussion, showed yeah. you some Notting Hill, especially if some people want to come and visit and living abroad. Yeah. Ever show us outfit. Okay, she looks very good. I really love it. You are very good, darling. Then But I'm already like so full. Yeah, we have so much fun. And uh, we always enjoy having our time together. The sister time is the best time. Sister time is the best time, especially in summer, and we are going on holiday soon. I know. Yeah, so we're trying. Very to fortunate. Visit our friends, and yeah. we really miss her so much. Yeah. And I think like we already planned a bit of. This and that. Yeah, this, this and that. And Guys, I we're gonna document actually, this, so spoiler. you're gonna have to watch it. Spoiler? Alert. I think. And we haven't had our girls trip for a while, so I'm really looking forward to yeah. it. Yeah. We're gonna document everything, so you will see. If we can guarantee you, and hopefully have fun with excitement. us. Exactly. It's gonna be fun. Yeah. And I hope you enjoyed the little day with us in Notting Hill. Notting Hill. Yeah. And I hope you liked our earrings and also. Let us know what's your next purchase. Splash the money. Splash the cash. You live only once. Love you. Leave you. Bye, guys. <laughs>